Right, I got my old Vincent out. This is first run for this year. I take it out for a run. Clean points, plugs and such as that today. I changed oil on it at back end of year. But normally I whip rockers off, put plenty of oil down. Rockers, which ends up down onto cams. Because we've been stood for like five months, she'll be a bit dry right cams I suspect. And I whip this plug out here. I think you can see that and uh, pump some oil down directly down there which goes into quill direct into end at crankshaft make sure there's plenty of oil at big end and such and uh, that's about top and tail of it put some fresh petrol in and whatever you don't want you and uh, we'll get out for a little run and see how she runs uh, and she's uh, 72 year old this year so we'll see how it goes I don't know if it's me or other people at the same. You get out at knack of being uh, able to stay at them. Yeah, I was just saying, you get out at knacker starting them. I've been using my commando and you know that likes you to tilt cabs one way so much throttle, give it a bolt and it starts. This likes it a bit somewhere different. And then of course me uh, one of my cameras is playing up, it's uh, and it sounds like old lasses and miss on, doesn't it? Must be a bit of shit in one of the cabs. I, uh, I got my rear facing camera on. We'll uh, just have to hope it works. Uh, it's, well, I think SD card's faulty on it, and it's uh, been a bit of a pain in the backside. With a bit of luck, I'll get it down the road and that miss will go off. It'll uh, clear it sent up maybe. One can hope. I'd like to say I've been on with something important, but I haven't. I've... Uh, not been doing a lot at all really I have this week just done one little job uh, I did a uh, Model G Royal Enfield for a lad I don't know, four years since he never did out with it, didn't even ride it uh, and it's been stood for four years and they couldn't start it and it were a pair of them ethanol through fuel taps what were on it and uh, the rubber had gone a bit shitty so I changed them, sorted them out and uh, it started straight up but it wouldn't run, it was spitting spitting like all the elite cab and I thought well there must be some shitty cab like like it were a bit weak or something so anyway, I uh, I just get round this bend. I 
I stripped the cab down and I ordered a, a, a service kit from Berlin. All oh, fibre washers were leaking like the doll dried out. Put a new set of fibre washers in it and cleaned all the jets out, or as I thought I had. And it was spitting that bad out at car, shooting flames out at car all the time. And I thought, yeah, it's been stood for long enough, it'll be one of those what's sticking. Anyway, uh, one of my old mates says to me, he says, he says, I don't think so, he says, I think it's a jet blocked it cab. And to be quite honest, I thought they were talking bollocks, but anyway, they were right. It won't, uh, well, if you know where jet block is, there's a little drill in it, jet block, where it comes up out at bottom into jet block and uh, there's a right little eyelid back at drilling luckily I had a uh, I couldn't get it clear I, but I'd uh, had a 12th thou drill which were just right so I drilled jet back out oh jet block Uh, put car back on it bolted it up, ticked over as right as a bobbin job sorted so we can take that back next week I need to get it out of the way I'm, uh, I'm a bit stuck for room I've uh, parted company with me Bonneville Um, uh, my matchless silver deck, silver dock is in Bonham's sale this week on Saturday if we a bit of luck it'll sell and a slice to that and uh, I've seen some I might like, have a little dabble at if it doesn't make silly money I might buy it I'll not tell you what it is I'll leave that for a surprise if I buy it My old mates who used to live here at the back of this pub. Fortunately, he's passed away. Unfortunately, when you get older, you certainly go to more funerals than weddings. This is Egbra Power Station, we all to uh, cooling towers knocked down. Different skyline round here. Ferry Bridge is now gone. There's only chimney now and buildings left at Egbra. Don't know when they'll be fetching chimney down like.
we're on the ride down here to one of my mates see if I can catch a cup of tea he's a uh, clever lad got some lovely bikes and all I was saying to him last time I was speaking to him I'd never ridden a note other than that 850 Commando Uh, and he was telling me how good Dommies one. I says, I don't know, I've never been on one. Anyway, he says, he'd give me a go on one at Dommies. I don't know if it's two or three on them. More bags than that weather sticker. He's a greedy git. He's got stuff from, I think, 1920s. All the way through. I hate this bloody corner. <laughs> 